The nene is like the bird of Hawaii. It's one of the few remaining. There were only 30 birds left up in the mountains, only 30 that were wild in the entire state. Although the nene's population has grown steadily, there are still only about 2,000 in the world. However, on Kauai, one population of nene are thriving, growing from five pairs of birds to over 400 and counting since 1999. This one location alone represents a whopping 20% of the nene population in the world. However, there's just one problem. The, the concern is that there's a large number of birds that are nesting and breeding, and it's a growing population on Kauai Lagoon's resort. But it happens to be right next to the Kauai, the Lihue Airport, right in between the two runways. Luckily, there is a solution to this problem, which involves the Hawaii Department of Transportation and the Department of Land and Natural Resources. So it's a public safety issue. So our job is to move the birds away from the Kauai Lagoons so that they're not a risk to the airplanes. But moving them in isn't as easy as putting them in a box and sending them to an outer island. And it's not cheap either. It involves capturing the birds, putting them on an airplane or a helicopter, flying them off, putting in a pen, and taking care of them, then tracking their movements, and then making sure they survive and reproduce at their new site. Total cost over the entire five-year period it's going to be about a million and a half dollars in the first year, and then it'll be about $800,000 each year after that. It turns out that moving them is not all that easy. It's an enormous number of birds, 400, 800, or 1,000 birds possibly. They've got to be moved in a safe manner so that they're not harmed. We want to make sure that the birds don't just fly out of that site and fly right back to Kauai. And so what we can do in order to get them acclimated to that new site is to clip their wings so that they can't leave the site. Initially, the cost of this project will be funded by the Department of Transportation. However, after the fifth year, the Department of Land and Natural Resources will have to find a way to keep the project funded if it's still a problem. Both agencies are working hard with the state to not only protect and safely move the birds, but to also protect the airline passengers coming in and out of the Lihue Airport. It's a, it's a big job. Um, but uh, it can be done, and we're looking forward to doing it. For Hikino, this has been Sheree Kua reporting from Chiefess Kamakahele Middle School.